to the chaos. <clears throat> this is another museum. Museum of another art museum. There it is, twelve dollars. Wow. I'll circle around it. <laughs> General, New Mexico Culture Pass, <laughs> you pay more. If you're a New Mexican, you gotta pay more. <clears throat> I'm still not seeing where the people pee around here. There's so many people. Where are they peeing? I still haven't seen that. I haven't seen, there's gotta be a public bathroom somewhere. Yeah, here it's Lincoln Palace parking, $3 per hour, 15 for the day. City of San Fe City Hall up ahead. And as I yeah, jump behind this wall and take a pee, don't know what business it is. But it's completely empty. You could quickly jump and, unless they got motion detectors, Georgia O'Keeffe Museum and it's completely empty. I thought they'd be open on a like a regular museum And they got a law office right next to it We're here City Hall up ahead Adobe star and then designer stores There's something called a community gallery some people wearing robes down there. It's probably not open on a weekend, especially Sunday. Sunday closed. So I don't expect to see anybody in there. Yeah, it's just another art museum. <clears throat> and you can write on a chalkboard. So there's a visitor center up ahead. Um, I'm taking it right into the convention center. I expect the visitor center to be open on a Sunday. It's busy as it is. And also have free bathrooms available. Wow, this is some big lamps. It's impressive. All a part of their conventions. This area is not locked off, so. And nobody comes here. You can freely walk in and out of the convention center anytime. Sweeney Ballrooms. And it's not being used at this hour. What time is it? I gotta hold until one. Oh, here's another turn. Wow. Is that in? Oh, okay. I'm looking at the reflection of this. I'm like, wow, that's inside? I wonder what those messengers had to bring to the Spanish. Maybe they gave their message of resistance and the Spanish didn't like that, so they, they killed the messenger. <laughs> Classic. Whoa, this, this uh, area's got a lot of space, a lot of real estate, and I came down that way. Hmm. Looks like some nice artwork. I'm gonna raise the camera up to look. Oh. 
That's curious. Actually, I could see better over this one. It must be parking. Not sure. Those are pretty cool iron bars. They don't keep anything out. Kit Carson. He wasn't he wasn't uh, buried here. Died at 59. <clears throat> I think up ahead I take a right. This this is the road to uh, the library. This is a courthouse yard. And there's a Scottish Rites Masonic Center Museum Library. <clears throat> I'd be curious to see if it's open or not. I've seen it before, but I didn't want to bother. It's just trying to get from point A to point B. <clears throat> I've never really seen Scottish Rite Masons together in a, a building like this before. Looks like almost a castle. Usually the masons are, are separate, but maybe I haven't been paying attention close enough. I still want to come up to the Scottish Rites Mason Masonic Lodge, but I see this this uh, immense statue over here. It's something that looks interesting. I don't know exactly what building this is that it's next to. It's a, but this is a separate park anyway maintained by the city more than this building and there's soft literature to read yeah that's pretty cool this nose this thing sticks out you can just grab it they really put in some detail into this so this is the guy being dispatched to Santa Fe from Mexico with 12 of his soldiers Don Pedro it looks like people are living very close to the downtown I'm sure it's not cheap because there's a lot of stuff going on around here that you have close access to it's a big advantage for particular people in particular positions. Looks like we got the framework for a new, whatever they call these Spanish style buildings. <clears throat> All right, and we got the dog swing. Barn dog, kennel, Don Kennel. That looks very sturdy. <clears throat> oh, it's the post office over there. Okay. I should have known. Post office next to the courthouse. The head of this bull moves up and down. I thought I was seeing things. Well. It's very subtle, but it moves like half of a foot distance. Get $15 when you what? <laughs> oh, this is the bank. I see. You can look right in. It's just windows. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to do that near that homeless shelter. All these open windows. Looks like parking right here is not even enforced. Century Bank. Employee parking 8 to 5 on weekdays. And they keep the gate open. So on weekends you could pull right in. I haven't updated this advertisement. December 15th. Well, would you look at that? No ticket on Sundays. I kind of like dehydrated or dehydrated yogurt flakes so there's this place uh, north of Santa Fe it's called Namby Falls Travel Center I could just stop in maybe sleep overnight I might try to sleep overnight in S Santa Fe I don't know there's a shopping center just a little north of here maybe a mile 
If that fails, I guess I got that 12 mile jump. I'm sure they had signage like that on the original. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's not very intricate, but it's neat. The Scottish interpretation of Spanish architecture. Looks like taking a right gets you to Hyde State Park, seven and a half miles, ski area, 15 miles, and there's definitely snow on the, on the mountains. Go down Artist Road, I'm at Bishop's Lodge Road. <clears throat> I need to take a left though. City of Santa Fe, Fort Marcy Complex, Magers Field Park. I don't really, it's kind of busy. Parking looks okay. Not too far from the the library. Uh, there's there's some kind of parking for complex three hour limit. Oh, <laughs> wow, three hour limit here. A bridge over a very dry riverbed. You see a lot of footprints down there. People just use it as a trail. It's just a flood path more than anything. Trees seem to be doing okay around here along this flood path. It must bring enough water for them to thrive, or at least do good. It's amazing to think that Spanish were traversing through this area at a time when Shakespeare was around in England in the, in the 1500s. Right on Rosario, I'm sure there's some enforcement, but there's no sign saying that there's a time limit parked here, being parked here. Right, so this is kind of a park people actually pulled up into it and parked in between trees and they don't like that. They want you to stick on the side of the road. Stick to the side of the road. Then an old bridge. They don't really make them like this anymore. I don't see any year on there. Jose Ortiz Pino. The dummy wouldn't even put a year. He just wanted his name on there. Right, Midland Bridge Company, 1920 over there. 1920. Yeah, that parking area would be something I'd do during the daytime. Not at night. I know, and, and even trying to park here overnight, I think it might be a disaster. They probably have security. This might actually be a mall. It looks like it's got a, a entrance for the entire building. The Vargas Center. Okay, all right. Yeah. Then it's, oh. <laughs> okay. Um, there's one. They locked most of them. Magic info? Yeah, but they might be closing down. The Bug Museum. Hmm. <clears throat> There's security down there. We're like the only two in here. I guess this isn't so popular. <clears throat> They got plugins for internet. It's quite a hangout. But I guess it's closing Sunday evening. Ooh, cookware. Expensive cook stuff. They might have something in there that I could actually use. I'm a little surprised that they don't have more businesses open on a Sunday. They got music playing, all the lights are on. <clears throat> Got Home Depot, some, I remember NBA Jam. Wow, that's a classic. Pretty neat this TV screen, but it's not like a touch screen next to the Ross, which is closed. Oh man. <clears throat> Maybe they're open from the other side. I don't know. Sunday five. Nope, everybody's closed. Yeah, this is a mall. This is 
I did not know it would be a mall. Shopping centers are a little iffy, but malls will have all night security. Don't even bother to try. The shopping centers, and if they don't have an inside corridor, and this mall is doing pretty good too. So it will really have, it, the better it does, the higher the security. How many businesses have I seen now where there's a guard cat inside? It's kind of amusing to discover that. I really don't think I could pick it up on video. It's a nice orange cat just laying in a box. Got a lot of gravestones here lined up in military formation. Not sure how well that could be seen. It'd be kind of cool to walk through that. I'm pretty sure this is the way north out of here. I'm not in a hurry to leave. I just, uh, I don't know where else I could park. I don't want to go back to the south. This looks like good parking right here overnight. St. Christus, St. Vincent, De Vargas Health Center, Credit Union. The health center uh, would be, this is not a part of the mall. I'm pretty sure this is separate. Hey, there's a way to get in. Yeah. Oh, I thought I saw a break in the fence. Well, this is as good of a break as I can get. I just got to take my backpack off. <laughs> in a min. I'm sure there's, I'm sure I haven't reached a, I'm sure it's not like trespassing at this hour. No wire tape glue. So this is the Santa Fe National Cemetery. I might have to leave the way I got in because I don't know how else. Well, there are people that pulled in. Just follow the road, I guess. Are we supposed to climb the wall? It's very climbable, but they got the driving area, the driving part blocked. Yeah, I don't know if I want to climb. It's just protection and they don't want, they got it up for a reason. They separate this graveyard from the other graveyards. And it's hard to say if this is for uh, military or probably not the military, something else. Definitely not Catholic. I bet everyone was cremated here. Probably not, not a single casket in this area. No firearms or weapons allowed in this area. That's strange. I've never seen that warning before at a, at a cemetery. They got some real rules here. So there's a diabetic needle in front. I did see two guys hanging out on the side of the graveyard in a, in a, in a channel, a flood channel. Um, yeah, so there's, there's some activity around here. Somebody actually took a poop on the ground. That's, that looks like human excrement. So there's, there's real activity around here with, um, homeless activity. Yeah, as a matter of fact, they're hanging out right there, still. I heard, I heard somebody yell narc. Yeah, there are definitely, I mean, it's just, I've seen three, but I just, there are, there are homeless people, transients around this area. It's, it's, it's questionable. The Pickney something house is trying to get out of the sh bright sun <clears throat> there's not many of those those uh, signs around maybe they're getting stolen all right oh look at that residential parking area I'll go a little further down